guys, it's Lily Pad Polish, and today's video I'm going to be showing you what I got for Christmas. So this was something that I did last year, and I decided I'd do it again this year. And the reason why it's a little late is because not everything that I'm going to be showing you in this video are things that I received on actual Christmas Day. Some things I purchased myself from Christmas money or gift cards and things like that. So I've just been accumulating some things and waiting for some orders to arrive and I finally have everything and so I'm ready to do this video. And if you wanted to see the one that I did last year, I'll have it up in the right hand side in the cards. And if you want to see how to recreate the manicure that I have on my nails right now, I'll also have that up in the right hand side in the cards. So yeah, let's get into what I got for Christmas. So first I have this box from Live Love Polish and it contains four beautiful polishes. So I have two from Starly and this one is a black polish with silver holographic chunks in it and it is so so pretty. It's called Neutrino or Neutrino. I'm not really sure how to pronounce the name but it is Gorgeous. This would be so pretty for like galaxy nails or something like that. That would be really, really nice. And then the second style polish is this one. And you can already tell it's a silver holographic polish. And this one looks like this. It is so, so pretty. I don't think I have a nail polish that is this crazy holographic. It is gorgeous. And this one is called Magic Rainbow. And it looks so, so nice. I can already think of so, so many designs that I'll be using this with. So this one is really, really nice. I love it. And then we have a fun lacquer polish and just the box itself is gorgeous and really holographic like how do they do this I have no idea but it is amazing um, and this is diamond hollow top coat by fun lacquer as I said before and I don't have any polishes from fun lacquer so this is a first and it looks like this. It is so, so pretty. And the little holographic pieces are so, so fine. And I can already tell that this is going to look absolutely gorgeous over a plain cream polish. It looks so, so pretty. I can stare at this for forever. So I'm going to put it back in the box. <laughs> and then the last polish is this one from Live Love Polish. And I also don't have anything from Live Love Polish. And this one is called Cake Pop. And it makes me super, super hungry. <laughs> um, and it looks like this. This is so, so pretty. Such a pretty pink pop polish and there's a little bit of holographic chunks in there as well I don't know if you can really tell it's sort of a little bit more subtle because the pink is so strong but there is definitely some hollow in there so those are the polishes from live love polish and then we have this cool little contraption um and this is actually the last thing that arrived to me in the mail today actually this is the unt or unt peel off base coat but i really quickly just wanted to say why hasn't everybody used this for nail polish it is so safe in here like it's all wrapped in this bubble plastic and it just looks so fun to play with um but here we have this little thing. I'm not really sure what it is. X White Renew. 
and it's for age spots, sunspots, and acne scars. So I will definitely be using this later today. <laughs> and then we have two of the Und Peel Off base coats. And they look like this. I did buy two because I knew I was going to love this and use it a ton. You guys know that I talk about in basically every video of mine. I always talk about this yellow stopper polish. And I use it as my base coat. As a peel off base coat so I actually have a mint for peel off base coat and I'm going to be using this a ton and I'll see what the hype is all about and maybe I'll even make a video on it if you guys wanted me to so I'm really excited to use those and then probably for the most exciting thing for me is this Melody Suzy 12 Watt LED Light Gel Nail Dryer. And I've been wanting some gel stuff for a really, really long time, especially once chrome powders and everything became all the rage. And I actually have a few that I haven't used, but we all know that they don't work with regular nail polish. So I'll definitely be using those soon now that I have this beautiful gel lamp and it says that it's violet right there I don't know if you can tell but it's actually not I think they just sent it in the wrong box and even the little manual says it's the violet series but I did order the black and it comes in here and it has a little connector to plug it into the wall so I'm just going to quickly take it out of this little wrapping paper. And it looks like this. Isn't it so, so pretty? I love it. It is gorgeous. And you have four different settings. I don't know if that's 30 minutes because... I would imagine 30 minutes is a really long time to be curing your nails. Um, but then we have 90 seconds, 60 seconds, and we have 30 seconds. So depending on what the nail polish requires. But I'm really, really excited to be using these. I can't wait to do some manis with gel nails and some chrome powders. I even have the Aurora Unicorn powder, I think is what it's called. Um, and I've been dying to use them. I've had them since probably August, literally since summertime. Um, so I'm really excited to be using that. And of course, as I said before, you have the little connector here so that you can plug it into the wall. And of course, with a gel LED lamp, we need some nail polishes. So that's what I'm going to be showing you next. So here I have some gel polishes. And this first one is the French Manicure Kit. And this was more for my mom than for myself, just because she loves to have her nails painted. She loves the classic French tip manicure, but um, because she does work a lot with her hands, it chips really fast when I use just regular nail polish. So I figured if I was going to get a gel lamp, I'd also get this so that her manicure lasts for a long time. And if you guys want to see a video featuring my mom where I do use this and do a French tip manicure on her, definitely let me know because I can do a little review on this kit while also having a French tip manicure tutorial on my channel because I don't have that right now, surprisingly. I just have these, which... I've already mentioned in the beginning of the video, but it's a gradient French tip, so it's a little different, but let me know if you'd like to see a video like that. And it comes with four polishes, so we have the base coat, we have two of the color coats, so one is pink for the base and then one is white for the tips, and then we have a no clean top coat. And it also comes with some nail stickers. So these are French nail tip guides and you have three different tips. So that'll be exciting. We'll see how those work. 
And then I think these are just some instructions. So that's what comes in that little kit. And then I got this one. It's Mickey or Mikey UV gel polish set and it has four pieces or four polishes. And I really wanted to get this set just because it's sort of the basic polishes. And because you obviously can't use regular polish with a gel lamp, I figured that I needed to sort of get the basics. And then I got some colors over here. So these basics are just red, black, white, and then a nude polish. I figured that those would be a good set to start with. And so let me just open up one of them. I think this is the black one. And all gel polishes or the majority are black just because I think that it's so that they don't cure or really get hard and thick when exposed to sunlight because that's how they harden. So if it was in a clear glass bottle like normal polish it probably really wouldn't work. So this one is super, super black. It looks really, really nice. I got this off of Amazon. Most of the things I'm showing you are from Amazon because Amazon Prime is what I live by. Um, so this was on Amazon and I read really good reviews. I read that they were really, really pigmented. So I'm really excited to do some manicures with these. And as I said before, I did need a little bit of color. So this is the Bundle Monster Gel Polish Nail Lacquer in Neon Wasteland. And as you can tell from the name, these are neons. So this is what they look like. We have a blue called Electronic Fields, a purple called Dance Trinauts, a green called Fairy Fantastic, a pink called Daisy Dust, a yellow called LED Airwaves, and a Cosmic Agogo in orange. So let's just open up one of these. I haven't really opened any of them um, just because I really wanted to do this video. And if I've already used the products, it's not as fun to talk about, you know? Um, so again, we have this black packaging. And let's see, I think that the labels match the color inside. Wow, that is so bright. I love it. Can you tell? I think that the camera is picking up pretty accurately. It's definitely a lot more brighter in person, but as you can tell, it is almost exact to the label. So that's awesome. It's a little bit brighter obviously than the label itself but these are so so pretty I cannot wait to use them I'm definitely going to have to do a little bit of a gradient using all of these polishes and then maybe I can apply a holographic chrome powder over top I've seen a few people on Instagram do that and it looks so so pretty it's like rainbow over rainbow and it's just it's amazing and that's all for this video. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I did actually post a poll a few days ago on Instagram asking you guys if you wanted to still see this video even though it was going to be a little bit late and all of you guys said yes. So if you don't follow me on Instagram, I do post some stuff on my story and I post some polls as well. So it's linked down below as always. It's at Lily Pad Polish. So definitely follow me if you aren't already. And yeah, thank you guys so, so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one soon. Bye!